Hello and welcome to the Cornwall Reports news briefing for Friday the 14th of October. The local media headlines today. And today is deadline day for Cornwall Council to submit expressions of interest for where it would like to see new investment zones. These are areas which the government is planning to designate for low business taxes and a greatly more relaxed approach to planning and environmental protections. Sometimes known as the Singapore model of economic development, County Hall is suggesting Falmouth Docks, Truro Newtown and Newquay Airport, but Conservative MPs Cheryl Murray and Scott Mann want Liscard and Bodmin to be included as well. Clearly not everyone is on the same page. It probably won't be an investment zone, but environmental rules around the River Camel could also be relaxed soon if council planners get their way. All we have to do is change the way we measure pollution. I wonder why nobody's thought of that before. And spare a thought for half a dozen Labour Party activists whose political ambitions will be helped or hindered today as officials draw up a shortlist of who might be the parliamentary candidate in Camborne, Redruth and Hale. The BBC was among the media to report the imminent dismantling of a sculpture which was part of last year's G7 summit legacy. The Mount Recycle More sculpture aimed to highlight the environmental damage caused by electronic waste. It will now be dismantled at the Eden Project. The Falmouth Packet had an update on the industrial dispute involving Cornwall's postal workers. Pirate FM notes a petition is gathering names in protest at the planned closure of Plymouth's ice rink. Popular with youngsters from the east of Cornwall, it's closing because of the huge increase in energy costs. The Cornish Times looks forward to yet more public consultation about flood defences in Loo. And finally, Cornwall Live is baffled by a TV quiz show contestant who was unfamiliar with some of our beaches. And those are the local media headlines for now. Thank you very much for watching. Please share this video on social media. I'll be back again on Monday. Until then, have a great weekend. Bye bye.